I'm on the number three of the Farming Simulator 19 tutorial series here. Hey guys, what's happening? Attaboy here. Today we're going to try out fertilizing. Learn how to fertilize your fields to get the maximum yield. If you guys like what you see, please hit that subscribe button and that thumbs up would be appreciated. You're helping out my channel. So you cannot work, mow grass, or cut trees on someone else's land. You need to buy that land. I love these little cards because they'll tell you little bits of uh, factual information in the game to help you out. All right, let's hit that start button. The most basic way to improve crop yield is to apply fertilizer. There are many ways you can fertilize your field using tools like manure spreaders, slurry tanks, fertilizer spreaders. Manure and slurry come from your cows and pigs. Manufactured fertilizer, solid or liquid, can be bought in the shop. Okay. In this lesson, we'll give you access to every type of tool. Get in the tractor, attach the weight, and the tool you want to use. So that's pretty cool. We got three trailers here, and I guess they all do different things. Like, one's the pellet, uh, manufactured fertilizer, the slurry, which would be a uh, liquidized poop, <laughs> and then we got the fresh poop from the cows behind here, horses behind, whatever, and they must sling it right out the back here. All right, and we have a John Deere 6230R, decent sized tractor. It's pretty nice. The weight up in front, kind of weight. All right, let's get inside. Nice modern interior. I guess it's got one of these air cushion seats too. That's pretty nice. Radio. Very cool. Okay, let's back up and get one of these uh, trailers here. Let's start off with the manufactured pellets here. Alright. Probably should have got that weight. Go up and get that weight. There we go. Outside view. Nope. If necessary, make sure to unfold the tool, then turn it on and drive across the field to spread the fertilizer. Outside view. Big trailer. Okay, drive on a fuel. Let's turn the spreader on. Oh, it's got a nice wide area. And re fertilize. That's where it's fertilized, darkens the soil because that's pretty cool. Okay, so let me turn this off because I want to try the other ones too. See if I can back this up next to these other ones. Perfection. All right. Disconnect. Oops. There we go. Actually, the wrong one. Let's get the slurry tank. Okay, let's take it out to the field. All right, liquid poop. <laughs> Oh, that's pretty gross. I can only imagine the smell of that, too. Oh, oh and it even has a little shine to it. <laughs> that's foul. I would hate to be back behind that thing. Okay, let's go. <laughs> let's go to the poop flinger. Same thing here. Show off my impressive driving backing up skills here. There we go. Alright, drop that and we'll get the next one. There we go. All right. 
right, solid waste coming at you. That's uh, this is the one we have to unfold. Okay, so it's looking like it has some choppers in the back and some flingers. <laughs> oh yeah, there we go. <laughs> Get your hot poopy. <laughs> oh, that's so yummy. Okay, very good. You have improved the yield using fertilizer. Next, we will look at using another way to improve the yield catch crops. On to the next phase. Oil seed radish is a catch crop, a fast growing crop. You plant before you crop the intended harvest. Once the radishes have uh, started growing, you need to break and burrow them into the ground with a cultivator. This destroys them, but adds a lot of organic matter to nutrients to the soil. Okay, so I guess we're just going to kill the radishes and mash them down into the ground and let them rot. So that'll build and, and replenish the soil with nutrients. Okay, so that sounds good. Try it. Go to your tractor. Attach the weight and a cultivator and cultivate fields as you do usually. All right, no problem. Let's take a look at the cultivator real quick. Just like the other one that we had in the beginning, except uh, this doesn't have a drum. Uh, it's got the rippers and looks like it has the discs that uh, rip to the ground as well. That's pretty cool and it folds up all right. We've got the weight. And this tractor, we have a Steyr 6300 Tura CBT. Not sure what that is. Pulling tractor for me. All right, let's pick up the weight. Oh, I'm just gonna grab the cultivator first. Now let's get the weight. And this is a nice tractor too. Wow. These are really nice. It must be like super comfortable. Alright, back on the outside. Let's uh, unfold our cultivator here. down to the ground. Oops. Uh, what did I miss? Oops. I am hitting the wrong tool. There we go. Okay. Now we're ripping up all the radishes. Smash them down on the ground. Let them putting uh, putting nutrients back into the ground. All right, that's good. Yep, got a little force there. All right, pick it up. Make another pass. Guess it doesn't matter if we're crushing them. Cultivator back down and start ripping again. There you go, another way to fertilize the soil organically. Well done, you learned a way to grease or learned off. Well done, you learn how to increase the yield with organic manufactured synthetic fertilizer and learn how about cash crops. In the next lesson, you'll learn how to take good care of your fields. All right. So that's that's definitely an interesting way. I always thought it was just kind of like you spread poop everywhere and and or whatever for other fertilizer and that's how it got fertilized. I didn't know you can make another crop and kill it off and smash it back down on the ground and put nutrients back on the ground that way. Well, very cool. All right, guys, well, I'm going to end the video right here. Thank you so much for tuning in on this one. Uh, if you like what you saw, please hit that subscribe button. Hit that thumbs up, too. And uh, catch me in the next one.